Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to turn your Windows 7 laptop into a Wi-Fi hotspot. I mean, this works for Windows 8, Windows XP, for all Windows. You can turn it into a Wi-Fi hotspot. Now, for this, you would need a wired connection to the internet, and the Wi-Fi must be turned on. Now, Google Virtual Router Plus, just like you see it here, and click on the first link, which is virtualrouterplus.com. Here, scroll down a little bit to click on the down arrow so you can download the latest release. Again, scroll down a little bit and select the download site which is closest to you for faster download. Now wait a few seconds. perfect your download is ready go ahead and save it I'm using Firefox I can go ahead and run it from here or go to the download uh, folder perfect just double click to run yes to your UAC now here select custom and uncheck all the checkboxes you don't want any additional software being installed. Next. Next again. And here's skip. Perfect. That way you just download the software, no additional programs. Next. And here in your case, it should say finish, but since I already have it installed, it tells me to modify or repair it. So I'm going to go ahead and click on cancel. In your case, it'll probably say finish and run the program. So this created a desktop icon. I'm going to close the remainder of windows here. Here it is. Just double click to run. Again, yes to the UAC. And it'll open the Vigorado Plus window. Here you can change the SSID like I did change the password but it must be eight characters long and the shared connection must be local area connection the wired connection to the internet that's what you're gonna share and start virtual router plus perfect virtual router plus now is running success now all you need to do on your other devices it just is just look for the SSID name here it is just look for the SSID name, select it, and connect. I can't do this throughout this video because it'll disconnect me from the remote access. Now, if you want to stop the Virtual Router Plus, all you need to do is click on the icon from the notification area and click Stop Virtual Router Plus. Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.